Hello guys and gals, and welcome to another episode of Unique Items. Today we're going to be looking at the Chieftain. The Chieftain is a battle axe, a two-handed weapon, um, that is uh, kind of a low-level item. But then let's go over it together and let's talk about what this item could potentially be used for. Isn't that right, Mr. Nene? I said, isn't that right, Mr. Nene? Uh, so right off the bat, you'll notice it has 24 to 64 damage. Uh, which is actually not bad for level 19. And, uh, you know, it, it it's not actually a bad weapon. I've actually used this on a couple different characters uh, in Diablo 2 as I've been leveling up. And, um, and as we go over it, I think you'll see. So it has a 54 strength requirement, level 19. It is normal attack speed for most characters but for druids it's actually much faster uh, because they do get a nice little bump in attack speed for two-handed weapons uh, the 20 percent increased attack speed on it is uh, a very nice addition and it also has a 100 percent increased damage on it which is static um, it also offers 1 to 40 lightning damage, which is actually pretty high at level 19, and it gives you all resistances plus 20, uh, which does vary from 10 to 20. Um, the all resistances is very nice in normal difficulty, and 20 all res is actually a lot in, in normal because you start out at zero instead of in the negatives. Um, it also has a very nice plus six to mana after each kill, which is static. So that means that every time you kill a monster with this, you're going to get six mana back. And this can be a big boon to characters that are suffering as far as their mana goes. It can even forego entirely the ability, you know, the need for mana steal around this level. Because most skills around this particular level are hardly, usually more than six mana per, per use. Um... Take Zeal, for instance, which is only two mana per use. Um, you could also potentially just use this on a Sorceress. Like, if you found it, um, it's all resistances, and it's plus six to mana after each kill. You could just plop it on, and you could just get the plus six to mana after each kill and move on with your day. And then when you find something better, obviously put that something better on. But, um, you know, literally just utilize it for the plus six to mana after each kill. The Ethereal version uh, has even better damage with 36 to 96, and it's uh, strength requirement 44. It's not really that good, though, because, of course, eventually it will break, which is, uh, which is not a good thing. Um, you can, of course, upgrade this, and um, although this is only a level 19 item, when you upgrade it to the exceptional version, it actually gets a nice little bump in damage, and we're going to go over that together. So to upgrade it, you're going to need a Ral Rune, a Soul Rune, and a Perfect Emerald. Um, and this is going to upgrade from 24 to 64 damage, 54 strength, level 19, to 48 to 154 damage. A nice little bump there. Uh, 101 strength, which isn't too bad, and level 30. So a very nice upgrade from the normal version to the exceptional version. The ethereal version also can be upgraded like this uh, from 36 to 96 damage, 44 strength, level 19, to 72 to 230 damage, uh, 91 strength, and level 30. Uh, not a bad little bump up there uh, as far as the damage is concerned, especially when you consider it has all resistances. It's got uh, plus 6 to mana after each kill. It's got the extra lightning damage on it, and it's actually uh, pretty fast on certain characters. Uh, of course, this character, this weapon can be upgraded a second time, and to do that, you're going to need a Pull Rune, a Lum Rune, and another Perfect Emerald. Um, the Elite version of this is going to be a lot higher level, it's going to be a lot higher damage, and it's also going to be a lot higher uh, strength requirement, so keep that in mind. So uh, right off the bat, bink, bink, we've got uh, 48 to 154, 101 strength, level 30. Oops. Pull rune. To uh, 98 to 274 damage, Decapitator, 33 dexterity and 189 strength requirement. Pretty high on the strength requirement there, with level 66. Uh, the Ethereal version, of course, can be upgraded as well uh, from the 72 to 230 Taybar, uh, 91 strength, level 30. To the 146 to 410 damage, 23 dexterity, so 179 strength. Uh, level 66 Decapitator. Uh, got that nice ethereal sheen to it as well. Of course, to utilize this, you would have to put a Zod rune in it, which is something that you can't get away from. So any ethereal item like this, if you actually want to utilize it for, uh, you know, 
for real purposes, um, it, it will eventually break. So you've got to put a zoderun in it and make it indestructible. I don't have one just laying around, otherwise I would just slap one in there. Um, let's take a look real quick, and uh, let's just let's go with a Whirlwind Barbarian real quick, and we'll just play with the idea of this weapon against uh, players. Uh, I think it's I think I'm on players one. Let me verify real quick just to be sure. Yes, players. We'll do players one Eldritch. I doubt it's going to do that well against players one Eldritch, but let's let's play with it anyway. Oh, color me. Uh, oh, this is normal difficulty. <laughs> I was super surprised there for a second. I was like, wow, this is doing really good. Uh, egg on my face. Isn't that right, Mr. Knees? Egg on my face. He said, what on my face? He said, let me in that shirt. So I'm going to go in there and I'm going to pee in your shirt. Get in there then if you want to go in there. He said, don't tell me what to do. He'll come right back out. He always does. <laughs> Told you. So this is Players 1, Hell Eldritch. Not exactly doing that great. Um, granted, this weapon, honestly, was never meant to leave normal difficulty, in my opinion. I'm a terrible whirlwinder, by the way. Burn me in the comments. <laughs> I killed Eldritch at least. Yeah. Pretty low on the damage. Not really that great. But um, I do feel like that first version is actually really nice for a low level character at level 19. And the second upgrade to level 30 at the exceptional version is actually pretty cool. I also feel like that plus 6 to mana after each kill could totally be utilized on a sorceress, uh, hurricane druid, all sorts of things. Uh, you know, If you really need the mana after each kill, which is a really nice stat at low levels, um, plus 6 is an awful lot. And could be combined with, say, an armor with tear runes in it, or a helmet with tear runes in it. Um, you could you could combine it with some other things relatively easily, and you could end up with what six, like seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Or sorry, oh, no, wait, wait, no, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. You could have sixteen mana after each kill relatively easily um, with a with this weapon, a tiered up armor, and a tiered up helmet. Wouldn't have very much mana issues at all at that point uh, for quite some time. Uh, let's take a look over on Silo's pen real quick and let's see potentially where we could find this item um, if you wanted to hunt it down. So the Chieftain. Uh, chief a chief a chief a ton, chief a chief a ton. Let's assume 50% magic find because this is a low level item. And uh, normal Mephisto, but this is a level 19 axe, so we need something lower than normal Mephisto. Normal Diablo, normal Veil, doo -doo -doo. Nightmare and Dariel. Actually, let's limit this to normal. So normal Mephisto seems to be the lowest level boss that drops this item. Let's take a look real quick at um, Super Uniques. Oh, you're knocking off my headset, sir. What's the matter with you, buddy? Hey, hey, I was talking to you. Hey, what is the matter? What is the matter? I can do the scratch this. I can Oh. He got mad at me. Um, so let's see here. We've got Lower Karas Storm Tree. That actually might be a viable farming option. It's the lowest one I see on the list. Not really a lot of good choices for a level 19 character. Um, Storm Tree is really the only one there. I think that you could reliably farm specifically for this item. 
I'm kind of surprised um, at how l not a lot of monsters there are that drop this item at like on level. Um, even Mephisto, that's that's uh, outside of the, the sort of the level requirement as well. Um, but it does look like normal Mephisto is your best bet if you want to get your hands on this particular item. Uh, do 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 do. -do. Anyway, as always, I do appreciate you guys and gals watching my videos, uh, even when I have to be the chieftain. And as always, keep watching.